Yo, what is good, my anime faithful? What is good? Honestly, this was a pretty amazing episode. Not only did they give us a really good send off to one of the characters that we've only known for three days, uh, they put it in a way where anybody who encounters this character more or less has a decent relationship with him, you know, like, they either usually find themselves, uh, infatuated with our boy, in the sense of just his personality, his way of life, just all these different things have continuously showcased that, yeah, Yo is someone that you truly want to have on your side and to have him on your side is not hard at all you just have to be yourself and not want to absolutely kill everybody and everything so if you don't have that going for you you definitely can be friends with this guy um seeing how much power he was capable of wielding thanks to this soul interrogation kind of makes you wonder uh, what the show could actually pull off at the end of the day, because if you think about it, if they're willing to do something like this, that just goes to show you that not only is it possible for someone like, uh, you know, like a cat like this one that had a physical form can be put in that position to, you know, sacrifice its their body to practically become a much stronger, uh, usable tool I wouldn't be surprised if something like this happens uh, for the final act like the beginning of his journey is going to do a full circle type of deal like yeah he had to use his friend in that way um, to win with, oh we bolted our specials will um, will he have to do something like that to yet again win so that is the true question and why I really do like where this is going because a lot of stuff is foreshadowing and a lot of things in shows that are kind of set in history do tend to repeat themselves in some way, shape, or form. Hence why we haven't seen any demons yet. They're probably saving that for, you know, later on, right? Like all of a sudden demons were nothing until this backstory kind of came along and gave us a look at what other things are out there outside of just people who are spirits that look like um you know humans or look like certain things that they were uh prior to their deaths passing to the other life so in that way it has me so curious as to where this whole narrative is going to come to an end. Of course, the good guy is going to fight the bad guy, but who's going to make it out? Who's going to uh, help our main character grow even more than he's already has? And what is the ultimate way that they can beat all of those people that are working for the main bad dude? So, with all that being said, I hope you are having an amazing day, night, evening, whatever the case may be. I am your boy the anime g and i will definitely be talking to you sooner than later i got to open and close at the job so i will be doing uh mostly mass videos for the uh, friday saturday so just an fyi if you all are listening this far into the video but yeah thank you all so much for the support hope you had a good thanksgiving if you celebrate it and i'll definitely talk to y'all in the next one so take care and peace